Uh, hello? You don't have to hide. It's me, your Rufikins. <laughs> ah, screw you. Hello, reception? Always at your service. What's your room number? Room one. Oh, the inspector again. If this is about the bedding, those aren't spots. Just a pattern. Which reminds me, do you often sleep with your mouth open? If so, then... Yeah, 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 fine. This isn't about the bedding. Ah, all the better. How can I help you? I would like to die now. Ha! <laughs> You've got guts. I like that. Have you selected something from the menu? You have kept your menu, haven't you? Oh, the, the menu? Yes, you got it here at reception. You are Inspector Cletus, aren't you? Uh, of course I'm Inspector Cletus. Who else? Uh, slimy hair, slimy character, uh, has no appetite anymore, uh, uh, would rather talk about something else. Uh, uh, Cletus, yes, in the flesh. I would like to speak to my assistant. Yeah, of course. I'll send him down to your room if that's all right. Oh, why don't you? And uh, tell him to sing the Dum Bum song on the way. <laughs> I'll pass that along. Thank you. At last. Now reception should be free. I just have to make sure I don't run into that Oppenbot. Here comes the dum bum, the dum bum, the dum bum, the dum bum, the doopy dim doopy dim doopy dim doopy dim doopy dim dum bum. Yes, what is it? You summoned me to your room. No, I did not. But you did. You just called to reception. I would certainly know what I have or have not done. I'm starting to think you're suffering from acute processor overload. But I heard your voice myself. If you aren't sure what my voice sounds like, then listen, and listen well. Never bother me again without a good reason! Understood? Yes, of course, but... But what? Ah, the inspector. Is everything to your satisfaction? <laughs> Far from it. I'm starving. That's fantastic. I like that. Have you selected something from the menu? You have kept your menu, haven't you? Oh, the, the menu? Yes, you got it here at reception. You are Inspector Cletus, aren't you? Uh, of course I'm Inspector Cletus. Who else? Uh, slimy hair, slimy character, uh, has no appetite anymore, uh, would rather talk about something else. Uh, uh, Cletus, yes, in the flesh. Ah, the guest from number five. Don't worry, the headaches go away after a few days. What? Uh, no, I I'm here about the menu. Hey, <laughs> that's funny. Most guests are gone because of the menu, you know? And our old cook is even in prison because of the menu. Can I have the menu or not? Lickety shit. You just have to sign this waiver form first. Ah, that's a snot rag. Yeah, well, there are just too many possibilities for being harmed by our meals. A form would be way too much work, and our lawyer suffers from depression. So we just copy the guest signature onto the appropriate waiver later. Very economical thinking. And please sign with a W in front. Uh, excuse me? Uh, Woofus? Yeah, the drawer for R is stuck. Oh, <laughs> of course. <laughs> Thanks. Here comes the dum bum the dum bum the dum bum the dum bum. Well, folks, I've got to go. <laughs> Finally, the dum bum. Dum bum.
Hello, reception? Always at your service. What's your room number? Room one. Oh, the inspector again. How can I help you? I would like to dine now. Have you selected something for the menu? I'll uh, <laughs> have the fish brain stew, please. All right, it's your life. Meal will be served at 12 on the dot. Please be on time. The dining room is guest to cockroaches, and the stew loves to chase those critters around the room. Yes, fine. Uh, please notify me in good time. All right, who am I to deny such a courageous man his last wish? Remember, room one, Cletus. 12 o'clock, Cletus. Fish brain stew, shovel, trash bag, all written down. I'll call you. 12 o'clock, understood. Thank you very much. Did I tell you? Hey, the art isn't making the guest feel like he's a king. Always nice, always friendly. Later, you can spit on their towels. Or their food, of course. Uh, very enlightening. Speaking of which, I have an order. Whoa, I'll be a platypus's uncle. It's already past noon. Mr. Cletus? Your meal is ready. It's waiting for you in the dining room. What meal? The one you ordered, you joker. Rat meat? Certainly not. Believe me, you'll think it tastes heavenly. Of course. Take your time. You see, that's how you do it. Always friendly. Select your phraseology, and when in doubt, lie. <laughs> Revenge is a dish best served with fish byproducts. Huh, locked. <laughs> Paranoid twit. Wet the duck! Don't tell me you're already finished with your meal. I was very hungry. Yeah, our meals will remedy that very quickly. I bet you can hardly wait to get back to your room. Here's your key. You'll find paper bags under the bed. What the? Oh, come on. The guy at reception gave me the wrong key. And here's the inspector once again. What a surprise. Is everything to your satisfaction? Yeah, nothing is to my satisfaction. You gave me the wrong key, Claude. Great snot, you're right. One moment, I'll fix that right away. Uh, I think I need a taste bud transplant. Did you say something? Uh, uh, yes. Uh, <clears throat> How about a juicy conversation? Before you give me the key, I'd love to hear your opinion on the major societal problems of the day. Once I return, that is. <laughs> huh? How the heck? Did I manage to choke down your chow? I'd like to know that myself. Come on, give me my room key. I need to rinse out my mouth as quickly as possible. I was just about to do that, but first, I would like to present you with a couple of my theories, as promised. What? <laughs> Quickly now. I have to stop Cletus from getting the right key. Did you know that broccoli was originally a failed military experiment? Poltergeists, earthquakes, and cosmic radiation as well. And that doesn't even begin to answer your question. What was it again? Can I have the key for my room? Oh, yeah, of course. I'm not feeling myself today. Lucky you. Oh, 
you're back again. Don't tell me there's another problem. Um, there most certainly is. You gave me the wrong key again. That's impossible. May I see? Uh, of course. Here. Well, I'll be a junkie's uncle. It must be because of my medication. I knew it was a mistake changing dealers. And can I have my key now? Just a moment. As soon as the effect dies down, the numbers should be back where they belong. I don't want to make a mistake this time. Shouldn't we perhaps consider changing hotels after all, Inspector? There is something strange going on here. Calm yourself, Oppenbot. The only strange thing going on here is your hat. Plus time shift, minus leap year, 12 up, 6 down. Perfect! The clock is working again. And here is your key. Please check it yourself. Yes, this is what it looks like. Um, and if I ever claim otherwise, you are welcome to thrash me. Really? Offenbot is my witness. Isn't that right, Offenbot? Um, why not? I have already witnessed so many strange things today that... Uh, what? Where did he go? Is everything all right, Inspector? Nothing is all right. You've given me the wrong key again. Really now? King of the cat burglars, king of the dog burglars, king of the other member of the animal kingdom burglars, Rufus! Ha! The bag! Finally! Now quick! before Cletus comes back. Uh-oh, approaching footsteps. Darn, that's Cletus. I need a place to hide. Ugh, another bite of this slop, and I'll have to brush my teeth. I should have known they couldn't cook in this dump. It's a good thing I have my champagne truffles with me. Otherwise, I would starve. 